hold on. Before I make a fool of myself online again. Hello there, trick-or-treaters, and welcome to another episode of Spookorama, where we talk about spooky things all year round. I'm your host, Cromwell Witch, and today we're doing a haul video. Boop, boop. So, uh, I'm not sure when I'm posting this, so at some point in the past, a couple weeks ago, last week, two weeks, I don't know when I'm posting this, so we're not gonna give definite times. At some point in my life this year, I went to Trans World Halloween and Attraction Show in St. Louis, Missouri. Uh, Trans World is uh, just uh, amazing. It's a convention, um, trade show, where people who run haunted houses, haunted attractions, um, Halloween biz peoples get together and sell their wares. And holy guacamole, there are some really pretty things there. <laughs> like, it's beautiful. Uh, I will have a kind of like, not a vlog, because you don't really see me, but like kind of the a vlog of my time at Trans World, just kind of like video of the actual show itself um, and lots of the booths and you guys are gonna be blown away. <laughs> it's amazing. I've seen people's pictures in years past, people's videos, and I always knew that was something I really wanted to go to. Um, and I'm so glad that I've really made an effort to get there this year. Uh, it was it was amazing. And just to see so many talented artists and creators. And, and I love Halloween props and the things that people make. And I have no idea how people make them. If I knew any, I wish there were like, I could go to like Halloween prop making school um, because uh, it's it's astounding. It's an art form. It's the things that people make. Uh, you'll see the video, and I'm sure you've seen other people's pictures, but it's just truly amazing. Um, however, I have nothing to do with none of that. I'm kidding, sort of. Um, I'm just a simple Halloween girl living in a Halloween world and we're doing a haul of the stuff I picked up. Did not pick up anything giant because uh, I'm a simple Halloween girl with a very limited bank account. And for the first time in known Spookorama history, I stayed on budget on a Halloween expedition. This has never happened before. This is amazing. Um, so I only picked up a couple things. They're amazing things that I kind of, the one, the one item I knew that I was definitely gonna uh, try and pick up. Anyway, so let's get into the actual haul thing. Again, as with all my haul videos, I'm so sorry, my camera is a butt and I can't see what's filming and it hates to focus on anything. So I'm not, you'll just see like a blur of something, but it is what it is. First up, let's go with the smallest item because I will lose it. So we'll just do it first and then I can put it on. This one I just picked up because I love aliens. I, that's probably one of my favorite movie franchises. Xenomorphs are freaking rad, guys. I love them. And uh, so I had to snag, see, it's just a blur, isn't it? This awesome Xenomorph ring. It's like a little chest burster. Um, and the tail is the ring part of it. But he's got his little teeth and his little this and he's ready to just burst out of your chest and become a big old, big old xenomorph guy. He's just a little baby, but he's really cute. And he just take a little alien with me wherever I go. Next up, we will talk about t-shirts. Cause as I say, every time I go to Texas Frightmare, nobody let me buy t-shirts. I don't need any more t-shirts. Please no one let me walk home with t-shirts. So this company, this one is filthy because I haven't had a chance to wash it yet. Because it's been sitting in my laundry basket. It's in, it's in the way. Um, this, both of these t-shirts are from the Halloween Shirt Company. 
and I could not find them on Instagram, so I don't know where they exist in the world of the World Wide Web, but they exist at least in some form because they sell t-shirts. I picked up this awesome Ghoul Scouts uh, t-shirt. Join Ghoul Scouts today. We need more ghoul. We need more ghouls in our Ghoul Scouts. I just thought it was really cute and especially seeing it's Curl Scout cookie season. I've been wearing the heck out of it because it's just fun. And look at her. She's such a cute little ghoul. She's adorable. So that's really fun. Um, the other t-shirt is not actually my t-shirt, but I'll show it to you because why not? This is really cute also. Got a kitten on a little pumpkin. Isn't that sweet? Yeah, it's really cute. And this one's a long sleeve t-shirt. And those were from the Halloween Shirt Company. But wait, there's more because in the coolest thing ever, y'all know I love tote bags more than life itself. Uh, I have a million tote bags. I actually am selling cool tote bags right now. Hint, hint, wink, wink. Go buy you an awesome spooky tote bag on my site. Um, so I loved it that this, this, this is literally the bag they gave us for the t-shirts. Like this was a free bag. This is just what they put this stuff in. And first of all, I love this. I love their design, the broomstick and the scythe. I mean, how awesome. And it just, it's, it's so cool. I love the whole thing. And then there are also stickers, which I haven't actually checked out yet, but they gave us a bunch of stickers, which is great because um, my laptop sticker, at least the one where I actually use the mouse over it, is wearing horribly, horribly thin. Um, my poor little headless horseman is uh, losing his horse too. All right, so we have a pumpkin with vines, a nice jack-o'-lantern there. This guy's oh my god, look at these trick-or-treaters! Look at them, they're amazing! This is what I picture you guys as when I'm talking to my trick-or-treaters. I just picture like this. I'm talking to a bunch of kids in Halloween costumes, right? Heck yeah, more trick-or-treaters. Look at that. Skeleton, Frankenstein, ghost, witch. It's me and the gang, guys. Me and the gang. And then their logo, the Halloween shirt company. These are so awesome. I love these stickers. I love stickers. I never know what to do with them, but uh, I love them nonetheless. All right, and the final item I got, seriously, I'm telling you, I walked away with only like three things. So I'm sure it's not mine. Um, I knew I wanted to pick up something from his booth. Didn't know what it would be, but I knew I was going to pick up something. Um, so going in, um, what were we talking about before my cat jumped up? here. Um, art. Art is a thing that some people can do. And I'm proud of them. Um, so I knew I wanted to pick, I have room, I re, let's go, rewind, rewind. So going into Transworld this year, there was one booth I knew I had to hit up. I knew I was going to grab something from him because he is amazing. And I'm talking about Chad Savage. You guys probably follow Savage Sinister, Sinister Savage. Oh God, now I'm messing it up again. God damn it. I'll put the right thing down here. Um, on Instagram, his artwork is amazing. I can almost guarantee you've seen it somewhere. He does so much work for different businesses, organizations, haunted houses, just his, his work is everywhere. And it is amazing. He's just a very talented artist. I love his style and he's got so many, sir? He's got so many really great um, Halloween uh, designs. So I knew I was walking away with something from his booth, but I did not know what. Um, but I had looked online at different things and I was like, no, just hold off. You're gonna go to Transworld, You'll be, he'll be there. Just get something good, you know, in person. And so I snagged an art print, beautiful art print. And uh, it's this one. And I'm hoping my light isn't reflecting on it too bad. Let me put it down here. Um, Cause it's, it's beautiful. I mean, I have, I'm just, it's beautiful. And I actually got the last one of these, um, but it's, uh, words, hard, but these, it's amazing. You've got the three pumpkin witches leaning over the little ghostly trick-or-treater. And this is 
just it's amazing this is, i'm so excited to hang this up and stare at it for hours on end because obviously i have too much free time no i make time for the important things staring longingly at halloween pictures it's beautiful and actually his card is right here so let me correct my previous probable instagram mistake Savage Sinister, ha! I was right the first time. Don't doubt yourself. Anyway, and I'll link his information below. I would also link the Halloween Shirt Company's information if I had any. Crinkle, crinkle. Um, I couldn't find them on Instagram, but maybe they have a website or something else. So if I can find something, I will link that down below. I'll also link Transworld, so you can like see it all. Or maybe I'll link nothing, because I forget a lot. Anyway, so that was my haul from 2019 Trans World Halloween and a traction show. It was delightful fun. I will have a vlog up sometime soon, or maybe I already do. Time's funny that way. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up. Uh, you're always welcome to subscribe if you want to see more Spookorama goodness throughout the year. I also am spooking it up on Am- or Amazon. What the fuck? Amazon is really getting to us. They're in our brains. I am also spooking it up on Instagram. Got it right that time. Um, at Cromwell Witch, if you want to give me a follow, you can see all the fun, um, spooky day-to-day -day shenanigans I get into. And as always, thank you guys so much for watching. It means the world to me. And until next time, happy trick-or-treating. <laughs>